Good morning. What's this on the side of my face? I can't believe it. It's sunshine. It's sunshine. It's sunshine. Hallelujah. Oh, hallelujah. I, uh, I've come out for an early, well, it's not really early, it's about 11 o'clock on a Sunday. I've come out for a walk, get some fresh air, get the, uh, get the steps in early. That's the idea. I've come to a really beautiful lake. We're going to walk around. Oh. So this lake is a, a nature reserve, so it's home to lots of lovely birdies and newts and what not. Has anybody read Where the Crawdads Sing? This reminds me of the scenery that I imagine in the book, Marshland. tell you how good it is to feel the sun. <laughs> it's just, oh, it's heaven. I had a bit of an epiphany walking around and thought, I should do this more often. I should be getting up early and walking around, and maybe seeing the sunrise or something. Is it gonna happen? Probably not. Beautiful day. Stunning. So nice to be by water. I think I'm going to be going that away. That's where the path takes me. It is bitterly cold. <laughs> I think it's two degrees, but it feels a lot colder. My hands are freezing. Onwards. Back in the car. <laughs> Got booted out of my space pretty quickly. Seems that I made um, the walk just before rush hour. So I've just pulled into a bit of a lay by because I wanted to think. I'm going to go to a town 20 minutes away because um, they've got a couple of car places. I think they're going to be shut on a Sunday, but I might be able to just walk around. I don't know. Maybe have coffee. Something like that, treat myself. And when I come home, I will do my yoga with Adrian and um, whatever else there is to do, which isn't an awful lot at the moment. That's what I might do. So, yes, let's go. Okay, I've parked at the back of a pub. <laughs> and the Citroen garage is across the road. Let's go and do a sneaky, sneaky look. really like that colour. It's called khaki grey. But it's brand new. Nobody can afford that. I quite like 
like one of these, but an older one. And that's a nice colour. So I found this really, really weird garden centre and it's got these little mm, shacky places and I specifically came for that, which was a, it's a cafe which says open as usual. I'm not sure that it is. Um, it's a bit weird. It is a bit weird. I've never been here before in my whole life. And it's, you know, in an area that I know very, very well. But I've never been here. It's very strange. Um, yeah, so I'm going to have a little look round. But it's a bit weird. A bit strange. Strange people. No, not open. Cafe's definitely shut. Uh, there's like signs everywhere. CCTV, no dogs, no dog walking. It's all very welcoming. And um, yeah, strange little huts with little businesses in, which I'm sure are lovely, but I'm too scared to go in on my own. You know when you just get a weird vibe? <laughs> I've got a weird vibe. So, I'm going to continue on to the little town, which is called Wokingham and perhaps we might find a coffee that'd be nice and then i'll probably poodle home to be honest car hunting is one of the most well yeah it's one of the most difficult things oh my god like you might find a car that you like and that you want to go and test drive but it's like in scotland <laughs> that's just gonna be too far away <sighs> found that really embarrassing buying this book <laughs> I felt like I felt like she could see through my soul like she thought mm, you think you're a weirdo that's why oh that's a fox that's weird um yeah I just think she probably thought you think you're a weirdo that's why you're buying a book <sighs> I kind of do where'd that fox go that was cool stinks of vinegar and I can still see patches of mould I think that I've missed slightly. I'm worried they're gonna come back. I might have to rub it over again which means it's gonna stink even more. Uh, I was gonna get a Gales coffee but to be honest they're so expensive. I think I mean it is nice coffee don't get me wrong but yeah so I went into Greg's two pounds saved about one pound forty. <laughs> oh my god, I've come to another garden centre and it's mega busy. I really need a wee. I bought this. <laughs> it looks pretty disgusting but I'm really hungry. Chinese chicken on a stick. <laughs> it's too busy man. I've got nowhere to put you moved from that other car park to come here because I don't want to go home yet and have a bit of a mooch. Um, I had to get petrol, bought my chicken on a stick. I've not had one of these before. Barbecue, no, Chinese flavour. God. What I kind of like is that it's on a stick so I don't have to touch it. Look! 
<laughs> that is revolting. It is kind of revolting. Also, I've just got a big bit wedged in between my front teeth. I can't get it out. Oh, how annoying. Mm. Right. I'm going to eat this and then. Okay. in. I've um, I've just been right. I've just been to the antiques place. Didn't buy anything. Very tempted by that um, studio pottery dish. Very tempted. Uh, for like a fruit bowl or something, but then I thought, you don't need it. You don't need it. Put it back. <laughs> Put it back. So, um, so I'm very pleased with myself that I did that, and, and I'm actually really pleased that I bought myself a book. Not that I needed another book, because I've got probably about 20 at the moment on the old uh, the reading pile. But this sounded really funny. Uh, Quietly profound and laughing in public. I can't read what's underneath the sticker. Laughing in public. Funny. That's the kind of thing that I need right now. That's me. <laughs> I actually quite wanted to go for another walk before the sun goes down. It's five to three. The sun's setting about half past four. And, and after that, you feel like your day is over. No, when it's when it's like pitch black you just think might as well stay indoors so I'm making the most of the fact that it's still blue sky there are some clouds now but it, there is still blue sky so I've come back to the same place that I was before the uh, nature reserve and I'm gonna go for another walk temperatures dropping again Oh, this lovely holly. Lovely holly. Get this walk done. Go home. Nice cup of tea. And read a few pages of book. Or, no, yoga first. Then read a few pages of book. Yeah, let's do that. Spooky Blair Witch kind of stuff. Spooky, spooky.
there's a driving range just there. Golf. Can you hear? There. <laughs> and, uh, yep, the balls have definitely got over the fence. That's pretty amazing. <laughs> I don't know how they've veered to the right so much. Ooh. Look at that. Now I'm worried I'm going to get hit on the head with a golf ball. Oh, I'm home. I'm home. I'm starving. <laughs> uh, yeah. Reality. <laughs> Need to clear up. Uh, yeah, starving. So luckily, yesterday, I picked up some spicy surimi California rolls. Just remembered. <gasps> so I'm going to eat these. And watching this YouTube channel called Solo Solo Travel, I think it's called. It's a Japanese guy. Have I told you this? I don't know. But he um, he travels all around and tries lots of different food, mainly Japanese, but um, he doesn't say anything. It's all subtitled. And I'm absolutely addicted. <laughs> addicted to it. He travels a lot on trains, different types of trains. And he has food and he vlogs it all. He And he sleeper trains and all this sort of stuff. I'm absolutely hooked. So... Uh, I'm just following one at the moment where, where he stays in Tokyo in one of those capsule hotels and then every day he's going out for food. Well, I'm just obsessed. So I was um, I was influenced to get some, some sushi. So I'm going to just chill out for a bit, have the sushi, do my yoga later when my food's gone down. And then um, hunker down really. It's um, 20 to 4 and I feel like the day's over. I feel like I've done so much today. Um, and it's been really nice having you come with me, so thank you, you kept me company, giving me a reason to go out, which is always good. So yeah, I'm going to enjoy these, watch a bit of YouTube. So I think it's just white fish, avocado, I'm not sure what else. Dippy dippy. Mm. Nice. Hat stand on man, it's cold this evening. Oh. All righty, day six. Let's come on down to the ground. You can reach it all the way up back through center and take it to the other side. Nice deep bend, Jamie. Inhale, keep it lifted. Exhale. 